This sales vision business games video challenge number 57 or 58, I can't remember, but say hi, baby. What's up? So we're doing the video challenge together. Um, Vincent and Mama G and I and Pops, we just completed our Live Mastery 360 Founders uh, webinar. And these are our members that... Uh, do very very intensive training with us and in this video I'm just gonna show you a little bit about what I taught them you know my style is keep it silly simple and uh, I'm all about the income producing activities um, as long as you're income producing activities and follow up then you should be golden and then you have to learn how to save your money and all that kind of stuff which mom mama G is gonna teach us that insight sales vision for wealth management later but in any case um, this level is called level two it's not about you it's about your prospects so number one when it's not about you it's about your prospect you want to think in your mind you want to give without expecting anything in return that means being nice to somebody without expecting anything in return I know that sounds very difficult for some people, but it's very easy for me. I don't know why. It's uh, something I've been doing all my life. But in any case, um, <clears throat> so an example of that is like if you're in sales vision, you know, make sure you participate in the syndication group. You want to add the other sales vision family members and build rapport, comment on each other's videos because that will help with your algorithm and also... Um, you're able to you know, build rapport with some of the newer members and uh, a lot of our Sales Vision family also have a primary network marketing company and people like um, uh, Ryan Huggins have successfully, you know, um, uh, you know, he's doing the 100 Day Video Challenge and then also he built rapport with other Sales Vision family members and now they're also in his network marketing company. So it's all good. Uh, number three, you want to comment on other people's posts on Facebook and like their posts. Because when you start doing that, then your posts shall be seen by them. And uh, sometimes uh, if you're doing the sales vision video challenge, um, they might not like your videos, but they're actually watching your videos. So you want to also share your content to the stories because... You'll be able to see who's uh, who are actually watching your um, content without actually liking it. And then what you can do is you can start building that rapport. All right. So number four, you want to look through stories in Facebook and like or love some of the stuff that appeals to you. So, for example, if people post about vegan stuff, I usually would send a love um, there are several people on my Facebook that are vegan as well. Hi, Nadine. I'm talking about you. <laughs> anyway, and then what you want to do is you just want to send them an intro message and focus on building rapport. Um, you know, when, when we talk about closing sales, that's another higher skill. So in this training, I was just trying to focus on teaching people how to build rapport without expecting anything in return. Do you want to say anything else? Yeah, I mean, that's key, what she's talking about. You got to give to receive in life. So that's the number one thing. Building rapport is about giving away value, too. So when you build rapport, if you're not giving somebody some sort of value that's going to enhance their life, then why would they care about talking to you? They don't care about your product. They don't care about your service. They want to know that you care about them as a person over anything. You can sell dog poop if you care about people. Like, there's, our, there's a company online that sells dog poop. <laughs> no, but for real, like, you can seriously, the people who become rich in life, it doesn't matter what product they're selling. It's how much that those people care about elevating the other people's lives. You can, people will literally buy anything from you if you give them the right love and attention. That's what people are looking for in life. So give it to them. Yeah, so you have to, you know, give people recognition. Most people who work a full-time job, they don't get recognitions from their bosses, their, um, you know, their colleagues or anything like that so that's why being an entrepreneur you have to learn to give recognition and um you know just a what's up and just build rapport without expecting anything in returned and then of course it's a higher level skill to then ask for you know um 
you know, figure out what the pain points are, and then you ask for the sale. It's very simple. All right, guys, I'll talk to you soon. Take care now. Bye-bye. Peace. Peace.